Okay, so I just want to show you some things that I have to get back on track with. Um, I promised you early on when I started my videos that I was going to be real with you and sometimes from far away everything looks great. Now I did just wash my hair so that's why that towel is there but I want to show you what I found and again I've been away for a while so I'm catching up so no judgment. I know you guys love me so anyways. Um, the raw and real. Okay so this is just from water sitting here. We have no fan exhaust fan in this bathroom so um yeah but that's the truth okay so i'm just going to be honest with you we're going to scrub this out in a little bit here but um i'm going to jump in the shower now get myself cleaned up and then we'll clean this out together okay but that's the truth and this is so gross that i shut the lid i'm not even going to show you that just because it's gross. That's the only reason why. But I'm gonna just tell you now that it is dirty and we're gonna clean it up. I started taking Christmas down a little bit here and there in the rooms, but just leaving berries, Papa Red until Valentine's usually. Okay, so let me get my shower and I'll get back to you. Okay, all cleaned up. I feel better, put that away. I'm gonna fill my jug, part of my New Year's Regroup. I don't like to say resolution. I'm just gonna try to do better. Towels down. Now, we need to scrub this tub. Then we're gonna get downstairs. I gotta look in my refrigerator, make a grocery list, and you can't see me, so I'm gonna go downstairs, look in my refrigerator, make a grocery list, and then I gotta go to the store. And then I'm opening my shop back up again today, so um, gotta go over there and work for a few hours. So. Um, just thought I would bring you along today and see what we can get done, okay? Now, as I said, this tub is gross, but I'm gonna be real with you. I'm gonna wipe the toilet down over here. It is too gross to show you, but anyways, it's okay. We're gonna get things done together and get back into the routine. Um, it's hard to keep a routine when you're not even at home, so. My husband has been gracious and helping me how he can and still working and so we're gonna get back on track here um i like to use this too because it's like in the back but and it needs double duty this time and then we'll get back on track and it'll be easy to keep up with it but for now all right so i'm going to scrub this but i'm gonna speed up the video for you Okay.
Okay, we're gonna take a peek in my refrigerator. There's not much in here. And now I need to get veggies, salad, good for you stuff. See what the avocados are looking like. Um, anyway, so I'm, I'm back on my clean eating. So <clears throat> I'm gonna need to get maybe some eggs. I'll just check the price on that. Um, I'm going up to my dad's tomorrow. So the eggs are cheaper there. Maybe I'll just wait and get them at dad's. Um, so I had yogurt. I gotta put those in my thing here. I have some eggs. My hubby's gonna want some bread. And I need almond milk. And I have cheese, but let me fall that out. I need veggies. I'll just get a variety. I have some celery down there, and I need salad. And I don't think I need any dressing, so I have some in my other in my pantry too. Um, I got half and half the other day when I came home. Uh, someone's gonna eat that hot bologna, so let's get this out of here. And then, I, okay. So, what I need to do is just get. Uh, I'm gonna write here. Think clean. And I'm going to see what's there. I know I need to get some chicken. And um, let's just let you take a peek at what I'm doing here. It's dark over here. Let me see if you can see this. So this is just my notebook. Um, this has worked for me, this plan, um, in the past. So I just thought it would give it another shot and be more consistent this time because that is the biggest problem with me. So, and life just got crazy, which you know. So I need veggies galore as many as I can handle and I'm just gonna pick those up that way um, but then I need avocado I don't want to forget that I have um, two no I need sweet potatoes we're gonna clean all this out because this is a mess so let me just show you Again, no judgment, doing my best, and I wasn't here. So this is the state of my fruit, etc. I'm gonna throw that one away right away, but my lemons are in here. My lemons here are like hard as a rock, and I haven't been here for a while, so. My bananas, I put some in a smoothie, but it wasn't very good, so we won't probably do that. So sweet potatoes, I'm gonna write potatoes. And uh, when I do this, popcorn is good. Good snap. I have some of that, so I don't think I need that. I just got nuts, so that's good. Basically, what this is is like just clean. Um, and I love this is like something I love. It's a go-to snack. I just dip this in peanut butter. I can uh, trick myself that it's like a Reese's peanut butter cup, even though it's not. It's not. I have oatmeal, so that's good. I just want to peek through here. I know I have fish. I saw that. I have the chicken on here. I have fruit in my freezer, which I'm gonna use in my smoothies. And I have peanut butter, so that's good. I don't need that. Um, I think I need regular mustard. I know that I have honey. And if you wanna know more about this, you can ask me about it. I need to see if I can get um, low carb wraps. That's enough, I don't know what I'm looking for. I'm gonna see what's the best option because I do like a wrap and you get tired of eating the same thing all the time. So that's a good way to mix it up, but it has to be that low carb. And I have oatmeal for that fluffy pancakes. I have fish in my freezer. I might be repeating myself here. I'm just looking at the recipes and stuff. I know that I have pumpkin out there if I wanna do it that way. I have cinnamon. I have my almond milk on here and the rice cakes, and I have brown rice. I should make sure that I'm gonna just put a, um, a big mark here by chicken, cause that's like <clears throat> a big staple, cause it's like more clean. And ba 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 ba, I don't use sweeteners. I'd rather go without than put um, fake stuff in. I have balsamic, um, eggs, Got it, cabbage. I'll put that by my salad. Cause it's just a variation on a salad if you like cabbage and um, mixed. 
veggies frozen. That's just an alternative way to do things, to mix it up. Okay, and so this is the same thing, just portion sizes are different. Um, if you have work peeking in on this, so this is the one that I have to follow. This is the one that um, Hubby follows, and really the only thing different is um, portion size because he needs more than me. And I could do, um, maybe I'll wait to do that turkey because this week is a little crazy yet, but maybe then I'll make a turkey next week which if you know we know how to do that, it's just look back in my other videos. I think it was around Thanksgiving that I made the turkey. <clears throat> and, okay. So I have beef, I have pork, which I don't eat a lot of with this, but I can. And beef I have in my freezer. We just, we were stocking our freezer all winter, so. And squash is fine. There's a lot of, um, I call them free things. Um, so I'll just scooch this up here. If you can see that it's a little dark, sorry. Let me turn, get a little more light on it. And then, so I can have stuff like this. And, um, but a lot, it's a lot of veggies, which I do love. So it's not an issue for me at all. If you're not a veggie person, this is not for you. But um, if you want me to share more about this, I can definitely. I did uh, the jumpstart day one, which was, it's, it's like a flush yesterday. And I'm doing that again today and Honestly, I didn't even eat as much as I should have yesterday because I just could not. <laughs> so this is not, if you like veggies, this is not a diet where you're going to starve yourself. Um, it's hard to get it all in, which is nice because you're not like uh, crazy. Like I can't do this. I can't do this. And then once I get through my my flush thing, then I, I will change it up. And um, then I have this just paper in here that's like different kinds of smoothies just to switch it up. And um, my hubby wanted me to check um, on the greens. I don't know what that means. I'm going to get rid of this orange. And um, so i got to run to the store quick because then I'm going over to work. I'll see if I remember to bring you with me, okay? All right. Hey, <clears throat> I just want to jump on here real quick. I'm going to the store, which I just told you. Um, when I re um, looked at the video, when I was editing it, the one that just went up, um, editing it last night. Anyway, the end of it is um, real, raw. Um, anyway, but I did want to say something else. So I thought I would just jump on here and talk to you about it while I'm going to the grocery store. Um, as I said, my mother was not well for a while. We knew she was not well for 10 months. She was going for that. However, um, people have been asking me, like, you know, like, I'm not walking around sobbing and whatever. And in the beginning of that one video, yes, I think it was the one I just uploaded. Um, <clears throat> I do look pretty rough at the beginning, and that's because I wanted to be real with you. Um... So, and I, um, but I'm not, I'm not crying all the time and people are asking me like, are you okay? They think I'm putting on front and, um, I just want you to know that I am doing okay. Um, I've been grieving for months and many, many times of sobbing and, you know, crying, you know, off and on last week. But I shared at work yesterday that what's amazing to me is <clears throat> if you're a Christian, you know, I don't know where it's found and I can't look it up right now because I'm driving, but um, the Bible talks about the peace that passes understanding. And I included that verse in the video that you would have seen before this one at the end. Uh, I want to say Philippians, but I'm not even positive in the moment. But, um, you know, I heard that verse growing up and, oh, that's really cool, you know. Oh, to have peace. And as a child, do you really understand peace and real turmoil? Some people, yes. But, you know, I remember thinking uh, as a child, wow, the peace that passes understanding. And 
and uh, but now what's amazing to me is this week um, week and a half I have experienced the peace that passes understanding and <clears throat> I love my mother very much and I will always carry her with me and I will always miss her and there's been moments when I wanted to tell her something, pick up my phone to text her, but she's not there. So those are the moments that are, you know, the waves of emotion, but the peace is so strong that I know where she's at and I know that I'll see her again and I know that she's well, she's not in pain anymore, and um, that is what's giving me the peace, and I, I've never experienced peace like this before, you know, I trust God always to work out details in my life, um, but this peace, I've, I've felt peace before, but this peace is like none other, and um, I just wanted to share that with you, and I'm sure I'll have moments along the way when I'm videotaping and um, I may get teary-eyed and that's okay. That's part of grief and that's going to happen for years and I'm okay with that. But I just wanted to pop on and tell you that I, I really am okay and dad is doing well and um, the family has said the same thing. The, the peace is just overwhelming that God has given us. So anyway, I'm at Aldi and let's go in and see what kind of trouble we can get into. And definitely see how many veggies I can find because I've been lacking in that so and um, one of my friends a couple of my friends will understand if they watch this I need vegetables so let's go get them Okay, so that went well, and um, I think you saw everything that I put into my grocery cart. I tried to show you that, and um, so I probably won't do a full-on grocery haul. However, then I came out from the store and I saw something that I hadn't seen in a long time. So we were chatting a little bit, and I'm watching the traffic, and um, so uh, because I have to go to work in my shop. Um, I'm not gonna have time to like actually put everything away right now, but so I'm not gonna video that part because I gotta go really, really fast. Um, it takes a little bit of time to set the angles up and whatnot, but I'm going to um, put the things in the freezer that have to go in the freezer slash refrigerator. And then um, after work, then I'll set my camera up and we'll take care of like the dry goods stuff. And, and in that too, like I know um, I said I was just gonna get things like so I could eat clean and whatever, but um, I do have to still shop for the other people that are in my house. So um, there were some things in there that I'm going to do my very best not to put in my mouth. 
because I am trying to get to my best health this year and um, I'm hoping that with you guys here with me that you'll help me stay accountable and we'll get that done together so um, I'm going to try to not really track that too much on here but hoping that you'll start to see the changes and my energy level will be higher and all of that that comes with eating um, healthier so all right traffic's moving so I'll chat with you later work's over sorry i forgot to bring you with me Now we can finally get these groceries put away. <laughs> 